Peace to nowhere land. To nowhere land. Come along if you can. Hey ho, come on, let's go to nowhere land. With Maggie and the ferocious beast. Great googly moogly. Message in a bottle. Whoa! Hmm. It looks like he's sleeping in again, Beast. <laughs> Let's go and get him up, Maggie. Time to get up, Hamilton. Rise and shine. Are you going somewhere, Hamilton? I'm going with you. Where are we going? I don't know. You're going on a hike. Oh. Did we decide that yesterday? No, I decided it just now. Are you ready to go? I'm ready. Me too. I'll lead the way. Wait, we're not going that way. We're going this way. Why? Um, uh... <laughs> because... Oh, okay. okay. Well, here we are at the beach. Let's play in the sand. Okay. Too bad we didn't bring our shovels. <laughs> Look what I've got. Ta-da! Oh. <gasps> Gee, thanks, Hamilton. Hooray! Ooh, I want the blue one. Wait, we're not digging here. We're digging over there by the big rock. Why? Because. Oh. Okay. Four, five, six. I think this is a good spot. Hmm. Okay. okay. Are we going to make a sandcastle, Hamilton? No. What are we going to make? A hole. Just keep digging, Beast. Okay. Hmm. There's a rock here. <laughs> it's a bottle! <gasps> it is? Uh, well, it could be. Let's see if it is. It is a bottle. Wow. <gasps> and there's something inside. Great googly moogly. <laughs> what is it? Let's see. Maggie, that's a perfectly good bottle. Sorry, Hamilton. What is it, Maggie? Hmm, I'm not sure. <laughs> it's a treasure map. It, it is? is? Yes. You go from here to here to here. Oh. oh. Until you get to this chest. Hmm. It marks where the treasure is. We can pretend we're pirates and search for it. I wish we had pirate costumes. We do. <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, wow. thank you, thank you, An thank eye you. An eyepatch. Army hearties. We take 40 paces due north from the big rock. Oh, goody. I'll lead the way. One. Two, three, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty. Aha! A stick. That stick is supposed to be there. Why? Why? Because. Oh. Maggie, what's next? I mean, arr, what be next, matey? Arr! Go 
blow the length of a kite string toward the big trees. I see the big trees. Now all we need is a kite string. There you go. Oh. oh. <laughs> Come on. We have to walk this way. Why? I don't know, Beast. <laughs> 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 Our mateys, we're close to the treasure now. What? Well, that's not right. That's the end of the kite string, Hamilton. No, no, it's supposed to end over there. Why? Um, uh, because. Oh. Hmm. Oh, there's the problem. Look at your foot, Beast. Huh? Oops. Sorry. Here, I'll help you. Thank you, Maggie. There you go. Good. Ha! Huh, that's better. According to the math, the treasure is just a stone's throw away. And look! Here's a stone we can throw. Here, Maggie, you throw it. Thanks, Hamilton. No, not that way. This way. Why? Because. Oh. oh. Perfect. Come on. There's the stone. But where's the treasure? Maybe other pirates got here first. No, we have the map and we got here first. You just have to look over there. Ta-da! Great googly moogly! The treasure chest! Hmm, I wonder what's inside. Aha! Surprise! <gasps> Great fizzy! With crazy straws! Sandwiches! With the crust cut off! Hamilton, this is wonderful. Oh, <laughs> Hamilton. Whoa. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Hamilton, this is the best treasure I've ever eaten. <gasps> Me too. Thank you for planning it. You're welcome. I enjoy doing it. A visit to Cake Town. Are we ever going to get started? I can't make up my mind. And I have to finish the laundry. Oh, Hamilton, you're so fussy. Hmm, this looks interesting. Where? Where? Cake Town. <gasps> Let me see. Oh, maybe I'll get some new recipes. I'm ready right now. <laughs> Rudy lives on the way. We'll stop off and see if he wants to come along. Thank you. I can never remember exactly which hole Rudy lives in. We better start calling. Rudy! Where are you? I'm up here! What's going on? We're on our way to Cake Town. Would you like to come along? Cake Town? I'll be right down. I hope he hurries. I can't wait to see Cake Town. You mean you can't wait to taste Cake Town? <laughs> yeah. I hope they have free samples. <laughs> Do you see anything, Maggie? Hmm. Nope. Wait a minute. I see something. Is it Cake Town? It's a hill covered with tiger lilies. Where? Let me see. Wow, you're right, Maggie. Tiger Lily Hill. Where? Beast, go to the left. We have to see this. Oh, all right. Oh, my. I love tiger 
tiger lily flowers. We have them in our garden at home. Hmm. <gasps> Your mom doesn't have tiger lilies like these. Oh, how peculiar. What's that sound? I think that sound is coming from these tiger lilies. He's cute, but he doesn't look very happy. None of them look happy. Hmm. What do you suppose is wrong? I don't know. Now hold on. Let's try to figure this out intelligently. What do flowers need to make them happy? I know, I know. Sunshine. But they have sunshine. They also need water. Yes, maybe they're thirsty. But there's a well over there. There you go. Easy, fella. Slow down. There, we're finished. Are you still thirsty? We have to go now. We're on our way to Cake Town. But we'll come back and visit you again. <clears throat> Goodbye, Lilies. <coughs> Goodbye. <coughs> Cake Town. Oh. oh. I wonder if they taste as good as they look. <laughs> Beast, stop, please, so we can take a closer look. Okay. Don't we see how it tastes? Good idea. Let's do it. <laughs> Aha! Beast? What? This piddly little piece? That piddly little piece would feed a party of 12. Let's check out the cheesecake. Yippee! Hi, diddly dee. This is the cake for me. Cheesecake is my favorite. I'd like the recipe. <laughs> Yummy! Now let's try that devil's food cake. <gasps> Tumbling teddy bears! You guys run along. I'll stay here. One cake we haven't tried yet, Maggie. All right. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. 
Oh, you can sing that again. We ate the cake. That was a mistake. We all ate too much. Now all our stomachs ache. Cheer up. We'll feel better soon. Oh. Turned out better, I'd say. Hooey! Look at it go! <laughs> hmm. I wonder where all these paper airplanes came from, Beast. I think they came from the sky. <laughs> Ow! Watch out! Good morning, Hamilton. Good morning. You should be more careful where you throw things. You shouldn't stand in the middle of the runway. Hmm. Hmm. You look different today, Hamilton. Oh, it's probably my hair. I shampooed it this morning, and the blow dryer makes it go silly. There. How's that? <laughs> hmm, you still look different. Hmm. Yes, you do. Are you more pink today? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, it doesn't matter as long as you're Hamilton. <laughs> I'm Hamilton, all right. Give him his picture, Maggie. <gasps> oh, yeah. I finished your portrait. Wow, it looks just like me. Don't you think? Hmm. Oh, that's what it is. You're wearing a different sweater today. I only have one sweater with an H on it, Maggie, and I wear it all the time. Then where did your H go, huh? You're not wearing it today. Ah! Where did my H go? That's what I said. It's gone, Maggie, look! There's only stitching left where it used to be. Oh dear, it's come off all right. I've got to find it. I've got to get my H back. Where could it be? It can't be too far away, Hamilton. When did you last see it? Let me think now. I got up this morning, and then I got dressed, and then I had breakfast, and... <gasps> breakfast! I saw it in the toaster! Great googly moogly! What was it doing in the toaster? No, no, no. When I looked at my reflection in the toaster, it was there, I remember. And I saw it in the mirror when I was brushing my teeth, too. And then what? And then... I did some housework. Maybe that's when it came off. Maybe I caught it on a hook. Or maybe I hooked it on a hanger. Maybe it's stuck in the vacuum cleaner hose. Hello. <laughs> Those are very lovely spots you have. Well, that's everything. I'm down to the bare walls. No luck, huh, Hamilton? But wait a minute. Hold on! There's something under this box flap! Is it your H? Did you find it? No, it's just a B. A B is nice, too. B is for box. I'm not a box, I'm a Hamilton. And my H is gone forever. Oh. Don't worry, Hamilton. It'll turn up, just like you found these two missing stockings. And a mitten, right? I don't have the matching stockings or mittens anymore. I feel funny without my H. I would lend you one of my spots, Hamilton, but... I know. It's too big. No, I'm scared you might lose it. Oh. Oh. Hmm. 
Maybe I can make something for you to wear in the meantime. Really? With an H on it? Of course. Oh, thank you, Maggie. There. H for Hamilton. And you really think I'll start to like wearing this? <laughs> sure. And Beast and I will be getting used to our new fashions right along with you. Maggie, I'm having problems with my horn covers. They keep going in my face. Horn covers should be worn back behind the ears. Here, Beast, let me help you. There. <laughs> Maggie! <sighs> Dear Beast, bend your head down and I'll fix it. There. That's much better. I'm having problems, too. This hat won't stay up. <laughs> it's because you're not using the chin strap I put on. But I don't like the chin strap. Oh. You're just not used to it yet. There. Try that for a while. Will you tell me when a while is up? Maggie! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> That feels better. Oh, this hat is giving me a crick in my neck. I'm sorry, Maggie. It's too hard for me to get used to a new look. That's okay, Hamilton. I know how you feel. I like my old hat better, too. And I like my horns out in the fresh air. <laughs> <sighs> and I like an H on the front of my sweater. But I haven't got one. Hmm. Hamilton, why don't I take your sweater home and have another H sewn on for you? A red one? I'll try. Oh, Maggie, I'd be so happy if you could do that for me. <gasps> Great googly moogly. There it is. <gasps> My H! Oh. <laughs> You had your sweater on inside out, Hamilton. <laughs> I guess I did. Sorry about all the fuss. That's okay. I'm glad you got your H back. <laughs> so am I. Come on, let's all go fly some paper airplanes. <laughs> Wait for me. <laughs> I'm right behind you, Maggie.